Guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we got something different. So we actually are doing a full brake swap on the Fiesta ST. And the reason why we're doing this is I'm a dumbass and didn't realize there's an autocross event tomorrow. So my brakes are completely shot. Um, and, and part of our build up to Baja was to get some of these autocross events and they've been closed because of COVID. So I was looking at the uh, SCCA we uh, website over the weekend and I was like, holy shit, there's an event at Las Vegas Motor Speedway. So thankfully I had all the parts. Um, I had to go grab you know, a couple pieces of equipment. I had most of it here. I had to grab some zip ties and, and a seat clamp and stuff. But um, yeah, I just figured, hey, we got autocross tomorrow. I already got signed up. So following this video, guys, we're gonna also do a, a, a racing video. Um, unfortunately, Monty's not gonna be able to come with me to, because of COVID um, and I have to go solo. So I'm gonna be filming that solo. But today, we got the full wave spec brakes, front and rear going in. And then we also have, one sec, Monty, we also have the, let's go over here real quick, Monty. Here we go. We also have the EBC brake pads as well. So, and we went with the red stuff just so they're, they're not as loud when we're not racing them. These are just the street ones. EBC makes a race version as well. Um, but you know that they are a lot louder on the, on the road and I still want to drive this and still be able to drive it daily and not be annoying. So we got the pads going on. We got the rotors going on. And then eventually as well guys too, I have the downpipe coming in. So we'll have an install video going there and then we have some steel threaded brake lines going on. Um, so we're going to get the brakes on today, uh, do an install video on that, and then like I said guys, to follow this we're actually going to be racing the car, so stay tuned. Guys, we just got the rear tire off. We had to grab some parts. But I wanted to show you guys how bad you never want your brakes to get like this. But you can see, I want to get close to this, and you can see how worn this lip is on this. Like there's a literal lip you can feel on both sides of this. These rotors are completely shot. Um, the pads are completely shot. And what happens is once these pads why they rub all the way down it's just metal on metal so you get this really nasty grinding sound and so you, and then you get these grooves and stuff and that's exactly what you don't want come on stay right there I'll let me grab these are the new wave spec rotors they're really cool I don't you know the technology is pretty cool with these so you can check this out this is gonna be replacing you know right on here once we get this pulled off get the assembly off this is gonna go on actually I think it goes this way yeah slips on right there then these will be going on these have these are slotted help with heat reduction and just so you guys know this is the I've never I know I, I know I, I mean I know a little bit about brakes but I've never done a brake change in my life so this is I'm this is kind of a learning experience and plus I want to do it because I'm gonna be doing all the preventative maintenance on this car when we're driving it so we want to be able to fix this thing and if we're out at you know the track or racing and stuff we want to be able to fix this stuff on the fly so I might as well get some practice here at the garage in a, in a controlled environment so, but it'll be cool too eventually once, guys, we'll get, we're going to switch these out with some uh, KW coilovers. We're going to do a whole suspension swap on this eventually, but right now, just focusing on the brakes, get these rotors off, get the pads on, and uh, call it a day. And I also, too, eventually going to swap these regular nylon brake lines out and swapping these with um, the metal brake stop, or uh, stop tech uh, brake line. So these will be metal as well. So we'll get going on these.
likes it going pretty smooth. Oh yeah, definitely. Once we get it the first time, we'll be able to freeze it yeah. in the next two. Yeah, and shout out to uh, the video we're watching. He's uh, Mark Mark Cup seventy eleven thousand subscribers. You the man, brother. This is a really great video. Just showing how to pull apart your brake assembly. Oh yeah. All right, guys, we just got the first caliper off. Uh, caliper, wave spec. Oh yeah, it's the, the series. It's the uh, front one, like I said just a second ago. Back one's being a bitch. Better go get some rust shit. Oh yeah, probably gonna go get it. One second, I'll show you guys. Not that you even care, but. Right, I'm gonna spray this. Just get some of this and try that. Put them in the wrong way, guys. Don't put them in like that, guys. But right you'll now, have, you'll have a real bad time. Oh, yeah. But right now, we're putting the pads in, the new ones. It's sexy. There we go. That's the right way. Nice. EBC. EBC red stuff, red stuff ceramic. I'm hoping these aren't super squeaky. That's why I got the. Uh, I got the red stuff and not the yellow stuff. Alright guys, so that uh, rust, rust the rust resolver Amazing. that we got that I just talked about like what twenty minutes? minutes? Yeah like a couple minutes ago. Popped straight off. It finally popped off. This was from the start. So Yes. Hell yeah. We're I'm so geek. We're like ecstatic that it worked. That shit was that shit was glued on there, bro. Oh yeah. Just like this one right over here, guys. It seems to just be the back ones that are glued on for some reason. Yeah, the front just came off nice, dude. All right, Monty, I have serious hope, bro. Oh yeah. I think we got this. Oh yeah. I think we're gonna be able to make that autocross event tomorrow. Easy. Please work. I, well, the thing is, the brakes gotta work after we get them installed, right? <laughs> oh yeah. We could throw them on and it could just all go downhill. Oh, but yeah. I'm 
not putting that energy out there, bro. We got this. Perfect. We got this! Alright guys, finally got the last one, last out of four. Alright guys, last tire's on. Finally. So, the first tire literally took us four hours to get the first brake on. <laughs> oh yeah. Last three went on in about two, so. Didn't do too bad for our first brake caliper and rotor swap. Oh yeah. Now I'll take it for a test drive. Bet. I'll film a little for you guys, just so you know. Smooth. Dude, silent. That was so smooth. You know, Monty, we should have recorded it before. We should have recorded the squeaky brakes. <laughs> oh yeah. We'll do it before and after. Well, anyway, guys, they were insanely squeaky metal on metal and now you guys just heard it when I came into a nice little stop I didn't want to jam on them because I just installed them but yeah they were quiet well that's it guys it took us about what time is it right now eight yeah so it took us about seven and a half hours to get the brakes done mind you our first wheel took us four and a half hours just because we were getting stuff figured out um, but overall guys pretty simple once we got the little things figured out um, and really you know we just went on a ride and I really am stoked with how they sound I mean they're absolutely silent especially compared to what we had. So, excited to have these guys. Tomorrow's our first autocross day. So, really excited to push these things and uh, see what they're all about. So, thanks for sticking with us, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. And if you can, check out our uh, Stuntman Stitch Instagram page. And uh, hope you guys like what we're doing. Thanks for sticking around.